<laughs> Today I'm at a badminton competition with 2,000 people. 2,047 to be exact. Hey guys, Badminton Becky, American Living and Playing Badminton in China. They are like an hour ahead of schedule. Let me change my shoes and get ready and then I'll fill you in on all the details. They immediately let us into the uh, waiting area. We didn't have to like wait with the other people so they're about to call us. This competition has an app and uh, it's a real time app with like, you know, the, the live scoring app. And we like, we're supposed to play in an hour. There's only like one game between us. We're gonna call our game next. There's the next game and then us. And I just saw like we were on the bus and I just saw it was like five games and then four games. And I was like, we have to get out of here quick. So we like took a taxi, zoomed in. Since we're playing so early, fingers crossed that maybe our uh, competitors won't get here in time. We are entered in the top 32 that are There are about 40 teams in our age group. Um, this competition is huge. Our age group is 41 through 50. In previous videos, I've said this is our bad luck competition. And I 100% honestly was gonna say, I misunderstood, it's not a bad luck competition, it's just a big competition. So there's many, many levels to get through. But it is our bad luck competition because I recognize the person that we're playing against on our first game is probably the team that's gonna win. So we have bad luck in our draw that we got the probable winners or at least second place if they don't win first. So, so we really don't have much hope on this first game. We've played them many times. The only thing is, um, I do know them. They are teachers at my school and school starts tomorrow. So hopefully they have like a class meeting or a school meeting or something and they can't show up. This competition is free, so nobody paid, so there's more of an incentive to not show up, I think. But we will see. I haven't seen them yet, and when we signed in, they were not yet signed in. So I'm really expecting them to call us any second. That's our court, right in front of everybody. We couldn't have a court in the other room where people can't see. Horrible, horrible, horrible. How embarrassing. This is the Shaman National Fitness Competition. Um, I've played this like every year since I started playing badminton. Totally free, the city organizes and pays for it and everything, which is why there's so many people because you can just play for free and there is actually cash prizes. Obviously you gotta be one of the better badminton players, but this is the competition where just kind of like anyone that likes badminton. So you can have a really wide variety of opponents. It's not like a normal competition. You know, like a normal competition, I might have like 20 people in my group because my group's generally the 40s to 50s. So, hello. <laughs> but we have 40, which is double what we normally have. Hi, hi Joe Jen. So what they're doing is because this competition is so big and so many people and every group has so many people, if there is more than 32 people, they are doing instant elimination. They are not doing small group. They're only doing small groups in categories that have less than 32 teams or people that have signed up. So like generally it's like the older group. <laughs> That's like the only one where under 32 teams have signed up. So we have about 40 teams signed up for our middle-aged 41 to 50 age group mixed doubles. So we are doing instant elimination. We technically survived the first round. Only a few teams, cause there's like 40 teams, but it's top 32. So most teams got to just enter automatically, like in the pull, they just entered automatically to top 32. There's a, obviously like eight teams that had to play an early round. Um, to see who would, of them which would make it into the top 32. So we did luck out with that. We just didn't luck out with our opponent. Now because the competition is for free and it's open to anyone in the whole city, you can play multiple 
things if you want and it's all free so it doesn't cost you any money so even though there's 2047 people playing I'm gonna guess definitely not half are not playing at least two different um, categories but especially with the young people um, the A group is 18 to 30 so they are the, the biggest group there's like half of the competition is them so I'm guessing about 800 people are probably playing too you know like men's doubles, mixed doubles, or singles, women's doubles, whatever. Like, probably about 800 people. So there's probably about 1,200 individual people playing 2047 <coughs> games. Still don't see our opponents. Fingers crossed. You have some of the city's best players, and then you have some of the city's just very casual players. It's the only competition I'll ever play. So, like, for instance, this game that's happening right before ours is uh, something like 18 to 3. So, <laughs> clearly outmatched, but just having fun. That's what I love about badminton and shaman is, you know, people just play for fun and the city supports it and this is all free and anyone can join and everybody does join it's not just the intense badminton group that joins all the competition it's like the whole city people that just play for fun are also joining this competition just for fun and that's awesome but it's also the city's best and our competitors especially the woman she is the city best for our age group <laughs> so but I still don't see her and they haven't called us and they won't call us to enter. They should have called us to enter by now because this game is more than half over, but they won't call us to enter until our opponents are here and they have not yet called us and I do not yet see them, so fingers crossed. Finished. They finished their game. And we're the next, we're the next, we're the next, we're the next game, but... They just entered. They're in line. They just entered. They're signing in right now. See? No luck in this competition. Just a little guard. You have to go in with your official. The game won't let you in by yourself. Hi. Okay, we have beyond no hope, but whatever. We'll play. Have fun. Here we go. Now we all knew what the result would be, but. I think we really surprised them and ourselves at how well we played, especially in the beginning. We really took the lead and we actually had quite a lead in the first part of the game. And I think it was a mixture of, you know, them being harried because they were so late, you know, and, and no one had any warm up time and they didn't have any kind of relaxing time. They just immediately had to like get in and go. So I think they were just quite not yet in the mindset and we were somehow more dialed in or maybe more relaxed knowing we had no chance and kind of them with friends. It was kind of a, a more fun game where we were, you know, talking smack and everything. So we actually did better than we expected. At the halfway point, it was 15-9 them.
Verdi. For sure, the best we've ever played against them. And the woman was like, have you been training? Like, your front of the net's way better. We haven't played with her maybe like a year. But I don't expect to win this competition. 40 teams. I mean, it would have been nice to get to top 16. I was just wearing his. Nikan, Ifu. Nijan. Available Better Together Badminton Partner Cotton T-shirt. Available at the Dragon Badminton Shop. Link below. But I checked my heart rate. I turned on my watch just for that one game. In that one game I burned 271 calories. And my heart rate was in the extreme for 14 minutes. That was probably our entire game. I was nervous and because I was working so hard. We've been resting for a few minutes, but man, look at Aja. He is all of a sudden soaking wet. This is also nice. They have the um, app is feeding into these TVs so you can see which game is going on and which courts and you can take a break accordingly. So there's a little break area here. <laughs> bye bye. So I have played in this competition, I think seven times. I think my first time was seven years ago. Aja and I have always played together, even during the years that I was not playing with Aja as my partner. We still ended up playing this competition with each other. Last year, there was definitely not 2,047 participants. It was still very big. It was in the same courts. It was also two weekends long, but we did have um, small groups. So everyone could play three, four games before being eliminated. Um, and this year, I could just tell in the uh, WeChat group, like, the organizers were freaking out about how many people signed up. But if this is a trend, maybe next year there'll be 2,500, and the year after it'll be 3,000. <laughs> I hope the city doesn't regret organizing this free competition for everybody. And I do feel pretty good about this time. And it was fun, and I feel like we did a pretty good job, and uh, we'll get them next time. Okay, see you guys next time on the court. Bye!